in our faith journey we need to help other people to experience the communion that we have with the lord dear brothers and sisters in jesus christ today we celebrate the feast of saint john apostle and evangelist and today we reflect on the gospel of john chapter 20 verses 1 to 8 and the first reading is taken from the letter first letter of saint john chapter 1 verses 1 to 4 in the gospel we see mary magdalene encountered the empty tomb and she ran and report to peter and john and they rush to the tomb and peter goes inside and see the things john also goes inside and believe in the resurrection of jesus so after teaching 3 years they do not believe in the resurrection they don't know about the resurrection of jesus as yes, my dear friends as human beings we need affirmations not one time two time repeatedly we need affirmations see when we are traveling to one place to another on the road we see the milestones okay okay 10 miles to the destination 5 miles to the destination 3 miles to the, the destination each time when we see the milestones it reaffirms we are in the right path and it motivates and encourages us even though jesus taught them about his death and resurrection even though they are aware situation comes they again question and here after the crucifixion of jesus they were disappointed they are worried they are sad they were hiding in the upper room but the moment they heard about the empty tomb they rushed to the place see and believe reaffirmation even a husband and wife they know that they love each other still they need affirmation again and again and again that help them to strengthen their bond so in our faith life too we need affirmations we need to be in communion with the lord so that give us the strength and affirmation and john reminds us through his letter we are writing what we have seen what we have touched what we have heard what we have experienced so we so experience and we share that experience with you to have the communion that we have with the lord and we want you also need to have that communion with the lord so that our joy may be complete the joy is complete because you also experience the same communion that we experience with god so when we are in one communion we become united in the lord that gives us joy and that complete our joy yes my dear friends in our faith journey we need to help other people to experience the communion that we have with the lord so that when others also come into the true realization of god and they fall into the communion of the lord it gives true joy and that helps us to grow in our spiritual life and it gives affirmation one after another so as we celebrate the feast of saint john the apostle let us reunite with the lord as they were united with the lord and let us help each other 
to be strong in our faith to support each other in our faith so that we may continue the communion what we have with the lord